Crypto Mediation. The exploration delves into the Aiken understanding of eternal life, contrasting it with the Christian interpretation presented in Hebrews. The Aiken belief in a life without suffering and in prostility. The channel crest against the narrative. The dual narrative. Eternal life, drawing poignant connections between cultural perspectives and biblical teachings. As the channel navigates through the intricate dance of language and identity, it deftly mirrors the egg and practice of using names and language to express both positive and negative attributes. The author of Hebrews employs a similar linguistic strategy, shaping a narrative that fosters a cultural bridge. The channel become the believers from those so so fresh an identity. The exploration ascends to new heights, weaving together the historical memory shared by the Aiken people. And the biblical narrative in Hebrews, the channel skillfully integrates the Aiken reverence for heroic deeds and past sacrifices with the biblical exhortation to draw strength from the faith of their spiritual forebears. Through this spiritual essence, inherited to see themselves as part of a larger narrative, where the struggle unearths of some. The spiritual essay from the Father and parallels it with the Christian notion of believers embodying the qualities of Jesus, the Son of God. This cultural parallel amplifies the message of Hebrews, portraying believers as bearers of a divine essence that shapes their character and guides their actions. As the exploration unfolds, the channel delves into the ethical imperatives ingrained in Ek and Proverbs, becomes a poignant metaphor, reminding believers of the dire consequences. But why isn't the for path of faith? The channel becomes a custodian of moral wisdom. Intertwining cultural proverbs with biblical admonitions for a harmonious narrative. In this expansive literary journey, the universal virtual cultural exploration channel. The exploration becomes a testament to the universal truths embedded in human experiences. Where cultural diverges with shared spiritual quests, as the channel unfolds the layers of history three, binding the knowledge of digital, binding the knowledge, binding the knowledge, viewers to partake in a profound journey of cultural enrichment and spiritual reflection. The collapse of the Ghana Kingdom Inn prompted a group of displaced Sanink, known as the Mans, to move south. Fierce fighters, the Mans conquered the Buana and Akwami states during this century, leading war refugees to establish new settlement areas in the Gold Coast. Refugees from the Akwami State and the Ivory Coast settled and established their own states, including Akwamu, Domoa, the Adansi District, Akrokir. Enjoying the Bono Kingdom, Bono, Manso, leading to the establishment of states such as Joban, Bekwe, Kumasi, and Kokofu. The Bono State, which played a crucial role in nurturing early Akan states, eventually succumbed to the might of the Asante Ashanti State Inn, 
Amidst these migrations and state formations, evidence of the Aiken speaker's origin as suggested by Dr. Journey. A journey that spans from the Middle East to the Kingdom of Jeddo, shaping the diverse and rich cultural landscape of the Aiken people. The Aiken people of Ghana, almost all the important aspects of the history and culture of the Aiken people of Ghana, have been recorded by writers such as Rattray, Buja, Merowitz, Donkwa, Fortis Opoka, Apaya Hedboa Sarpong, Nyanza Karamenting, and Alanangya, while a repetition of their conciliatory, the Lazai, Akan people, and their concepts of ethnicity and social identity. These concepts are scattered in many works on the Akan people. Aiken is the largest ethnic group in Ghana, making up of the population of Ghana, Ghana Statistical Service. They comprise the Bono Asante Adans, Tuifo Asinfante Akupam, Akwaho Sawio Wenzima and Ahanta Ba. The name is the Kermos Genuine from, from Kan, a Kan or a Kana corrupted by the early Arabs of the Sudan in Ghana and the early Europeans who visited the coast of West Africa in Guinea. The best-known representatives of the Egan race are the Ashanti, Fanti, Akim, Akupem, Asin, and several of the present Twai, speaking races of the Gold Coast, Donkwa, Akins have a rich variety of dialects which are related and intelligible, include Asante, Akwap, and other listic elements. Akyotekim, Akonintianta, Puum, Ajakim. The use by some scholars of the name Akan. They use by is more or less with the ethnographic use of the name Akin, Dolphin and D. Akin is spoken as a native language in, of the regions in Ghana, namely Ashanti, Eastern, Western, Central, and the Brong Hafa regions Ajakim. There is hardly any consensus on the origin of the Akin people. Some of the suggestion in the Oliampa Iampa, Burgess of the Vial, had close connection with Israel. The inclination of majority of scholars is towards the southern part of the Saharan region, whether identified with the old Ghana or Mali empires. There is, however, Greater agreement that it was in the southern part of West African forest region that the ethnogenesis of the various Aiken groups took place. Aiken ethnicity, Shumwe, observes that ethnic identity in Ghana, as elsewhere in Africa, is neither a real Aiken, Fonte, and Asbu are manifestations of shared experiences among communities that evolved over time. With this changing nature of ethnic identity in mind, the interest of this article is centered on the views that are known to be operational in many Aiken thoughts in terms of who Aikens are. Some cases, such views could be traditional and not necessarily what all icons now hold. Adu Bohan, a professor of history in Dolphy and Dolphy and Third, Government as Cultural Traits and Institutions Identical with All Icons in Addition to Language. The Seven Matrilineal Clans, called Abujua, 
identifies inheritance through the maternal line as one peculiar practice of the Aiken people. Blah, blah. That this is true whether in terms of property or stools. TQ. It has, however, been noted that though the acupems are CQ from the patrilineal side, Eshen, chastency used to be used to be used to be used to be communities, according to Dolphine. She intimates that on the coast the gas and use were ruled by their local priests and that chieftaincy among them was introduced for the convenience of governance by the British Dolphin Purse Com. July, the Akin-speaking people firmly rooted in the Niger Bend cultivated a vibrant cultural tapestry that evolved in tandem with their matrilineal social structure. The decline of the Wadans over the indistically filled <laughs> Establishing a socio-economic foothold through activities like pottery, livestock rearing, and trade. Simultaneously, the Tebus, having made a brief sojourn on the Niger Bend, decided to journey even further southward to Gabon. The Gons Jia Group witnessed the success of the Ganja state and were inspired to forge their path, giving birth to the Bono state in. This marked the inception of a series of Akka including Kuyin-Triket Mostri and an Aqua Mostri. Watch out for the next video in our series. Once again, you are welcome to the ultimate voyage through the fabric of human existence. Culture Scarps Trekking. Join us as we take you on an exciting journey through time, revealing the secrets of the past, present, and even the mysterious passageways of prehistoric times as we go across the cosmos and explore the core of human history, culture, and existence. I'm ecstatic to be your guide. Fishy guide. Fishy.